guys, it's Candace Brock with Two Fab, and we are here with celebrity stylist Salvador Camarena and Anna Kachikian, and we have this week's Two Fab or Two Drab. Here's the first up, we have Kim Kardashian, and she's in Beverly Hills, leaving Barney's. I'm liking this Kim K maternity look. It's a wolfer dress as a skirt. I'm gonna give my girl Kimmy K a Two Fab. I'm gonna say a Two Fab on this look. Like, I love Kim's neutral color palette. And what Kim knows how to do really well is dress for her curves. And I feel like she's definitely dressing for her curves, but also dressing that baby bump up. Like this is a look mostly any pregnant woman can wear too. Too, too fab for me. Uh, she's been killing it lately with this pregnancy. The only thing that bothers me, the straps with the long dress, it makes her legs look shorter than they are. Uh, I don't mind them. I wouldn't be surprised if I saw this outfit on her lifestyle blog down the line that people are really like, oh, she's a mom and she does this. And I like, mm -hmm. I relate to her now. Earlier in the week, she Instagrammed a new pregnancy pic and she slammed did. all her haters who are saying she's picture? faking it. I mean, I, it's good. I did, but I yeah. just think like pregnant women are like beautiful and glowing and to quote Beyonce and Nicki Minaj, feeling themselves. <laughs> so like good for her, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. And I think that's great. One of Kim's friends, Sierra, she's out in New York City. She recently revealed that she lost 60 pounds of baby weight in Shape oh Magazine. I'm sorry, that ruffle all down the middle, it's just kind of making me a little uncomfortable. Too drab. Well, I'm gonna say too fab. Sierra has stepped up her style game. Ever since she started dating a Seattle Seahawks Russell Wilson, this look is so fab. I like the 1970s poochie esque vibe this dress is giving me. Vertical stripes, they're flattering. Sure, it might be too much for some people, but she's beautiful. It goes with her skin tone. Again, it's to play on neutrals. I like it too. I'm sure from behind especially, she looked banging because it's cinched mm -hmm. forward. So from the back, it's just like, it's gonna be all right there for you guys. Again, it's the, it's the neutrals. Like, yeah. it's so trendy right now, and she has such flawless skin. It's just glowing. She did a change. Yeah. And I loved that look. Mm -hmm. But this, I'm just not. I'm sorry guys, I'm not feeling it. Okay, so this is Christina Milian. She's at a pool <laughs> party in Vegas. Oh, and is it I hate this. Too drab. Too drab also, for obvious reasons. Like, I know she's at a pool party. First of all, the fringe doesn't work, but is she wearing a scuba shirt attached <laughs> to the fringe? And why is it it's paired so with? Weird. Right? It's like scuba It's, yeah. it's right. so odd, because I was yeah. like, is that her hair right. or is that? French. Her nipples don't even want to be in that shirt. Like I feel like this should be at Stagecoach Country Music Festival, not a pool Ooh. party. So now we have Kristen Stewart, and she's at the Tonight Show, smiling, which I feel like we never see her this happy. She's wearing a DBF romper, and I'm gonna give her two fab just because she's really rocking this with confidence. I'm gonna go two fab also. I think she looks adorable. Actually, she looks. Salvadorable, because she gets my approval. <laughs> I feel like she's giving me 1990s Winona Ryder reality bites realness, which mm -hmm. I dig. I love this, how she wears this with the hair and like the throwback, like, you know, choker kind of black necklace to match. I was very inspired by this look, so it's a two pop for me. Okay, so now we have Gabrielle Union, and she's at the Straight Outta Compton LA premiere wearing an Acris tuxedo dress. I love it. It's too fab. I'm gonna go too fab and too drab. So I'm gonna stay right here. Gabrielle looks 50 shades of fabulous, right? <laughs> we all see it. She's tailored well. She looks great. Yeah. But she's a thief. What? Because she <laughs> sold this look from Emma Stone at this year's SAG Awards. She might okay. be straight out of Compton, <laughs> but she's straight out of copycat <laughs> right now. But so, it wasn't at the same award show. Doesn't matter. Fire hold. Hire me, fire hold. <laughs> at first when I saw it, I was like, oh, it's pretty. Now I'm looking at it and I'm like, I don't like it. I don't know how I feel about this. So I'm gonna be nice and say too fat. Do you like these? No, too drab. <laughs> <laughs> but it does fit her really, really well. It's tailored to perfection, which is great. And if you're gonna wear something like that, it should be, you yeah. know? Okay, we have Emmy Rossum. She's at a summer TCA party in LA. She's wearing Alessandra Rich. Too drab, I don't like it. I don't, I just am not a fan of ruffles. And it's just, this is just weird for me. Um, I'm gonna have think? to go uh, too fab because I think Emmy looks like ethereal and beautiful and light and airy. And, Unlike you, I like the transparent kind of ruffle 
thing she has going on there. I think she looks beautiful and she has like that really light porcelain skin that this works for her. So she looks like a little like doll. This was my favorite look from this entire week. All well, the color, the length, her shoes, the back of the dress, I melted. I like melted. A yeah. Well, I do like the back. I'll give it, it a two tab on the back. It's so beautiful and it's so perfect for this weather. It just works for her, you know? She's that girl. I don't think we'll ever see her in like a salacious jumper or anything like that. Yeah. I feel like that's who Emmy Rossum is. Okay, so now we have Miley Cyrus's rumored girlfriend, Stella Maxwell, and she's at a body by Victoria's Secret event in London. Look at this girl. She's smoking hot. Two fab on the sequin dress. Right. It is beautiful, the high slit. She's a model, right. exactly. Ooh, model right. and skin and bones, like the just the way I like it. Pull this, pull this beautiful. Off. She looks unbelievable. Here's a question. Miley Cyrus has dated Liam Hemsworth and is rumored date, dating a Victoria's Secret angel, right? Mm -hmm. When did Miley Cyrus turn into the female equivalent of Leonardo DiCaprio? <laughs> this is unbelievable and she's beautiful and I'm a sucker for anything gold and shiny, so mm -hmm. I love it. I dig it. I mean, what, what, what do you say? She's a Victoria's yeah. Secret supermodel. Too fab. Thank you so much for joining us, Salvador. Thanks for having me. It was fun. And that was this week's edition of Two Fab or Two Fab, and let us know what you think of our picks in the comment section below. Thanks for watching.